love them or hate them, why Scorpio risers are attracted to people with Aquarius placements. Hey, it's the birthday coach Jeremy Ryan saying you were born for more. You deserve more love, happiness, success. I hope you do that with the secrets of astrology. Why do we get fatally attracted or deeply in love subconsciously with people that have Aquarius placements? Now, a lot of you may not even realize this when you first start dating. You're like, oh, I'm dating a Gemini. I'm dating a Virgo. But, you know, if you get their birth time, many you are going to find out, oh, they have an Aquarius moon. I can't even tell you how many Scorpio risers find themselves smitten with somebody with an Aquarius moon or Aquarius Venus or their big three, rising sun or moon in the Aquarius sign. Why is that? Why is that? Why can that be good and why can that be trouble? Well, it all goes to the fourth house in whole house astrology. In whole house astrology, every Scorpio riser has Aquarius in the fourth. What people don't understand about the fourth house is, yes, it's your mother, it's your family, it's your upbringing, it's even the home that you create. But what people don't understand is the fourth house is the very roots of who you are. It's the deepest level that goes down to the depths of your soul. That's why a lot of Scorpio rising people are very much, as they grow older, progressive, open-minded, very friendly as far as being loyal to friends. Because deep down in the soul of a Scorpio riser, the very root of who they are, there is that Aquarius flavored zodiac traits, characteristics. But the fourth house is the house of our roots. It's also what we call what many Vedic astrologers would even call the house of our happiness. Because down in our roots, when we get to our core and we're doing things that resonate, that go way down in us, it feels like home. Have you ever said, this person feels like home? I mean, it's a romantic, romantic, you know, romantic line. And you look into their eyes and you say, when I look into your eyes, I feel like I found my forever home. <laughs> now, I know, I know you're saying, Jeremy, don't make me sick. All right, don't be doing that corny crap. But hey, I am a romantic. I am, you know that, Pisces in the fifth house. But why can it be difficult for Scorpio risers to date Aquarius placements? Well, Aquarius, and listen, if you are out there, Scorpio risers, because many of you Scorpio risers will have Aquarius moon, will have Aquarius Venus. You'll have Aquarius somewhere in your chart. You may be a Scorpio risers with a lot of Aquarius in your chart. And most likely, I would fall head over heels for you. I tell you, every time where I have that, what they call that instant, oh my God, ah, they always have an Aquarius somewhere strong in their placements. Um, but it can be bad. Why? Because in your natal chart, if the fourth house is effed up, and some of you got fourth house issues, Saturn there, you got Pluto in the 10th that's aspecting the fourth, or, you know, you know, you got a fourth house that is in your natal chart, it's not easy. Now you bring that Aquarius person that feels like home, it feels like they, they just resonate like a soulmate. Well, they're activating, I'm screaming, sorry. They're activating that fourth house. So it makes sense that you would fall for an Aquarius because they just feels like, it just feels right with them. They just feel, there's a, it just, you know, that instant karma, that instant connection. But if you got a trouble with the fourth house, you're going to have to deal with all that trouble. So that really means that that Aquarius that feels like home can really just be a sign that you got to love yourself to heal your fourth house. In fact, I would say until you have healed your fourth house issue, your mother issues, everyone hear me, until you have dealt with your mother wound, you want to be careful with people with high Aquarius in their charts because their Aquarius person, sooner or later, it's going to trigger the mother wound, which for a lot of us, the mother wound was what? The distance, the hot, the cold, the distance, the, the seriousness. I mean, you know, there's a lot of stuff we can go into. But for this video, so I can hurry up, did you know that that's why you're so attracted to Aquarius and that even without knowing anything, when you get to burst time, wow, they got an Aquarius. Because your fourth house Aquarius, it's your home. It's how you would also, the people you feel like you would want to start a family with. Many of you marry Aquarius because this, this, I feel, feel like 
this is who someone I can have a family with. So with that being said, I thought it was a little fun thing to throw out there why so many of us Scorpio risers fall for people with Aquarius placements.